Now we're going to look at the Find Children's Books tab of the guide. So we'll click on that. Okay, the best way to search for a book in the library is through our library catalog. And in this case, uh, it's good to go through the guide because we already have it narrowed down to the juvenile subcollection and our specific campus, as you can see there. So we'll type the title of a book as a phrase search in the box. And hit search. This is what we call the detailed record for the book. Uh, you can see at the top all the publication information, the name of the author, the title of the book, and that sort of thing. And if you scroll down a little bit, you're able to see other information like a description of the book. You typically see a summary of the book. And what is particularly useful for y'all is the awards section. Um, in this case, this book did win the Caldecott Medal in 2015. Um, one of the most important things on this page is this box right here. Uh, you're able to see the location of the book, which lets you know which library owns a copy of it. You're able to see the call number for the book, which lets you know where the book is on the shelf, and also the status of the book. Uh, to make sure it's checked into the library and available for use before you go looking for it and it not be there. You might see that we have two copies of this book. The first one is in our easy book room, and all of the books that have the E up front, that means that they're in our easy book room, so you know um, kind of where to go to look for them. We also have a copy that says juvenile reference. This means that we have a second copy that is for library use only. Um, one more thing I want to point out here, uh, you may notice that other campuses also have a copy of this book. If for some reason our book was not available, uh, like in this case it isn't, uh, you're able to request a copy from another campus because you do have borrowing privileges at all of the U of H campuses. And to do that, you would just need to go up here, uh, click Request, and log in as it instructs you. Um, okay, so I'm going to show you another example of this kind of search. Let's get out of that. And we'll try... the lion and the mouse, and hit search again. Okay, you'll notice this time that not just one book came up, uh, we have several. Uh, and this is very common when you look for folklore, fables, fairy tales, because you do have different versions of the same story, different imaginings of that story. Um, so let's go ahead and click on the first one. Okay, again you see another detailed record page. Um, you have all the same kind of information, um, the description, summary, and this book won several awards that year, including the Caldecott Medal. One difference you'll notice is that it doesn't say Easy Book Room here uh, under location. Instead, it says Juvenile. And also, the call number doesn't have the E in front of it, so again, we know it's not in the Easy Book Room. And that's because um, our nonfiction and folklore and fables and fairy tales are located just outside of the easy book room uh, and they're organized a little bit differently so the numbers look different. 